Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to describe how to draw a random sample in SPSS. So first of all, um, if you have a big data, for example a data of around 6400 cases uh, in the SPSS, for example if you see this data, uh, this has 6400 cases, how do you know that? Go to analyze, go to descriptive statistics, uh, click on frequency, click on uh, draw the frequency table for any one of the variables uh, let's say all right all the status um, and if you click on ok then you see 6400 number of cases that's a big number and if you want to draw a random sample from that data set then how do you do that so it's pretty simple guys <clears throat> first of all um, it's better to have a variable uh, like serial number which helps to identify which uh, sample um, to generate. I mean, uh, identify the number of, uh, identify those people who are in the randomly generated sample. So it's a serial number and uh, it starts from one and ends in 6400. So um, the first step is go to data and uh, go to select cases. This option, um, random sample of cases click on sample so two ways you can do it one is uh, by the percent for example if you want to generate like 10 percent of the sample size from that 6400 that is um how much is that 10 percent is 640 um so if i write here 10 percent of all cases and then click on continue then it will filter 640 cases out of 6400 cases uh, and another technique is if you know the sample size and want to generate that number of cases um, by random method then let's say uh, 200 cases from the first 6400 cases and then click on continue and then click on ok so when you click on that then you can see that certain cases will be selected and certain cases will not be selected. So majority will not be selected because we opted to select only 200 cases out of 6400 which is very small percentage. So there is additional variable which is created uh, at the end of the data set which is called filter underscore dollar. So if you sort this by descending order then you can see that those cases that are selected will be on the top and if you scroll all the way to the bottom here you can see that up to 200 cases it has selected so you note down these numbers the serial numbers because these are the cases that are selected that will be used for another purpose uh, that is um, for, for anything um, the reason why um, you selected those 200 cases so this is how uh, you generate the um, random sample out of a big data set uh, using SPSS. Thank you very much. Um, please uh, do like, comment and uh, subscribe uh, and also share with your uh, colleagues. Thank you. Bye-bye.